내가 Thanks for tuning in this Wednesday. 2K Sports presents the NBA. This is Kevin Harlan. With me tonight, Greg Anthony and Richard Jefferson. And joining us courtside, reporter David Aldridge. Now the starting group for the visitors. In its small and power forward, it'll be Wiggins and Green. Some kind of shooting in the backcourt for him. It's Curry and Heel. And it's Looney into the pivot spot, manning the middle. And for Chicago, we've got Gasol. Carter is out there with Morant. Then there's Luka Doncic. And it's Mashburn in at the power forward position. Here we go. And it's Chicago to start out. Now here's Morant. Driving in. That one's in his first shot this game. Any trip that ends with Morant going to the hoop, it's great for his team. And here's Curry who brings it up for the Warriors. Greg, with how explosive John Moran is, he has certainly taken his fair share of awkward falls. And that's what worries you with guys like that. He's already had a number of injuries in his young career, but we all just want to see him at full health. Ashburn, no good. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. Healed against Carter. Curry kicks to Wiggins. Back to Curry. Five on the clock. Healed outside. Let's it go from deep. Chicago grabs the miss. Here's Carter. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It's going to be on Andrew Wiggins. Obviously, Vince Carter's ability to defy gravity is eye-catching. But everything else he does on the floor equally as important. He is a complete player. And just over a minute played here in the start of the game. Curry with it. And it's Carter picking him up. Out left of the wing. Outside Curry. Just five on the clock. Back to Looney. Over Gasol. That one a little long. Chicago with the ball. Here's Mashburn. And he dunks it right in, right on Buddy Heel. Oh, man. And this is how special Mashburn is on the drive, using that athleticism to just explode towards the rim. Curry with it. Wiggins, right side. Pass to Looney. Green with the ball. Curry on the wing. Lock at six. It's rebounded by Gasol. Here's Chicago. Here's Meshburn. And he takes that one up and powers it through. And this sort of awesome dunk is one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game. Well, there's a swagger out there. You can see it on the court that they possess I'm not, I'm and are not, not afraid to show it either. And so Steve Kerr calls for the timeout. Wants to talk some things over. Might be seeing some things to adjust. Dominguez come in for Draymond Green. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Kaminga finds Curry. Shoots over Morant. Curry can't get it to go. Chicago leading by five. Here's Carter. And he drops in the way up off the glass. And they've scored several times already here in the first quarter on the inside. 
Outside, Kaminga. Pass to Wiggins to stop the run. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Here's Carter. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. Carter's got six points. And creating a little separation here, gaining some confidence. Yeah, they've locked in during this stretch. If they keep it up, their lead will only continue to grow. A minute 50 left to play in the first quarter. Pass to Wiggins. Shot from 12. Hit some rim on the way in, and the bucket's good. This is where Wiggins can be really effective. His mid-range game can really do some damage. And when you think about Andrew Wiggins, championship-level defender for sure. He can get in a guy's shirt without fouling him. He has the lateral movement to keep all handlers in front of him. Really tough to do, especially in isolation. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. He'll gladly take those. Excellent at dishing the rock. Luca with the nice feed. Curry kicks to Wiggins. 51 seconds left in the first. Curry looking it over. Six on the shot clock and off the left side of the rim and it swirls in for him. Well, Curry's accuracy makes the mid-range easy pick as he just goes up and nails the shot with ease. Morant passes the card. It's good from long range. Nine points in the game so far. And that's exactly what he's looking for. Draining the triple. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and game. That's a two from Heal. A rebound by Gasol. Got a good look there, but just not able to hit from the mid-range. And he makes that one. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. Yeah, they haven't appeared in a rush at all. They are just playing to their strengths and building this lead out well. It's stolen by Carter. Here's Morant. That one falls, coming off Carter's feet. Morant's got six. So as we end the first quarter, already a double-digit ball game. It's Chicago, up by 12. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter. So far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in a second. And taking a look at Chicago's performance here, guys, uh, what have they been doing or not doing? Just a terrific first quarter, sparked really by their unselfishness. They are playing for one another and focusing on making winning plays. You love to see it. And here's Melton. He'll bring it up for the Warriors. A 12-point game, setting the floor for the Warriors. Kaminga steps in at the four with Green sliding up to center. DeAnthony Melton out there with Pajemski. And it's Moody in at the three spot. And so here is Chicago after the Warriors pick up three. Edwards' shot is good. And unbothered by the contact inside, Edwards plays the game with so much physicality. Now Melton pass to Kaminga. Shoots over Leonard. And he can't bank that one in. Here's Maxi. Brings to the hoop. And slam dunk by Maxi. I just love the pace that Maxi plays at, constantly applying pressure to the defense. And we play through the first uh, minute here in the second. Inside. Here's Green. Some solid defense from Aiton. Nice contest, a high level of energy. That's how you play defense. From 13, that's good from Edwards on the assist by Maxi. Man, that's what they're looking for from Edwards. Scoring from all areas of the court, time even mid-range, keeps the
the defense honest. And so Steve Kerr calls for the timeout. And coach has decided they need a moment to talk things over. Jackson Davis has checked in for the Warriors. Pass to Melton. Here's Moody. Jackson Davis finds Moody. Leonard against Kaminga. Milton passes to Moody. Four on the shot clock. Outside, Kaminga. Here's Milton. And again, it's the Warriors missing. Chicago leading by 15. People like to debate, and Greg, I don't know if this is you, what's better, Kawhi's defense or his offense? Well, Kevin, I'll say this. Even if he was a subpar defender, his offense alone would have him among the league's top players, but his defense isn't subpar. At its best, it's elite. Here's Kaminga. Kawhi Leonard making his last shot. Melton passes to Kaminga. Empty that time from Leonard. Here's Chicago. Good momentum. Eight straight points. They get it again. He can't get it to go. And here's Melton. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. And slam dunk by Maxi. Remarkable work in transition. Maxi just overwhelms the defense when the break is on. Maxi's gone two or three from the floor. Timeout, timeout. And so Steve Kerr calls for the timeout. He's ready to talk things through with the team. with the new group. Different look here for the Warriors. Kevon Looney is checked in for Trace Jackson Davis. Andrew Wiggins comes in for Jonathan Kaminga. On a heel, he's checked in for Brandon Bajemski. And Curry subbed in for DeAnthony Melton. And Thompson throws it down. An impressive athlete. I like seeing Thompson take it inside and drop the hammer. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Curry against Young. Curry dishes to heel over Young. And the Warriors miss again. No matter what looks they get, they just can't convert to stop this run. This is snowballing for them. They've got to get a good look next time down. Now, here is Young. Carter kicks to Thompson. No good on the triple. And it's the Warriors' ball. To the paint to end the cold streak and healed with the lay-in nice move healed showing he's not just a three-point shooter chicago leading by 19. here's young and there's the drive hook it off the crossover young's got his first points of the game when you allow good scores to get uncontested shots at the rim no wonder you're losing that's a great possession. Put your best players in a position to succeed. Moses. A nice shot by Moody. Assisted by. And so it's Young who brings it up for Chicago. Pass to Thompson. Carter with the three. That one is good. He's only missed one shot of his six taken on the floor. The high basketball IQ of Clay Thompson. Finding a better look there. Now, here's Moody. Defended by Carter. It's tipped. First person. And the Warriors making a change here. Green's checked in. Substitution for the Warriors. Number 23. Draymond Green. 
36 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Back to Curry from deep. Chicago grabs the miss. Carter right side. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Talk about execution on the offensive end. They're leaving nothing on the table right now. It's caused them to pull away a bit. Let's see if they can keep the train on the tracks. 16 seconds left to play in the first half. Curry against Young. With some arc. Curry with the bucket. Curry's got six. And how about the terrific use of the crossover there to just throw the defender off down. And then Carter with the dunk. Just playing with poise and confidence. And they continue to put points on the board. And it's because they're not playing in a rush. They're just letting their shots come naturally within the flow of the offense. And so it's Chicago. Holding a very comfortable 25-point lead as the quarter comes to a close. The scoring has been tremendous. And they are shooting lights out with very high accuracy. Right back after this break. Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Look at Vince Carter in this game. I mean, he's been everywhere. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. You love guys who can get their shots within the flow of the offense. And after a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. So with Leonard on the bench, here's the group that Steve Kerr has on the floor. Morant is out there with Carter. Then it's DeAndre Ayton. Then there's Doncic, and it's Mashburn in the power forward. It doesn't matter if it's off the bounce or off the catch. Curry never loses rhythm on his jump shot. Morant, and finished up by Morant. Mm, that is ferocious. <laughs> you said it. That was ferocious. Morant's gotten everything to drop so far. Shooting four of four. Curry passes to Looney. Outside, Green. A three ball. And he's good on the three ball. Green's got six. Green's four stretching ability, one of the things that makes this offense so dynamic. And to me, Draymond Green really embodies the idea of a high IQ player. He can read the opposition, predict where a play is going, and those instincts aren't something that can be easily taught to anyone. Curry kicks to heel. Back to Curry. Pass to Wiggins. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. Curry's got three assists in the game. There's the pick. Morant reaches to Ayton. Morant passes to Mashburn. No one near Doncic as he lets it fly from outside off the mark. Doncic has gotten just one of his four attempts from the floor tonight. Heald can't hit. Chicago leading by 23. Here's Morant. Oh, yes, he did. Five up and five down for him so far. He gets a lot of defensive attention, but Morant, he can expect this type of rough scene anytime he takes it inside. Timeout called the Warriors.
minutes into the second half of play now. Here's Heald. Over in the corner. Looney. Curry against Morant. Shot clock at six. Spins. Rejected by Gasol. On the wing, Doncic. Covered by Heald. And it's good for two. Doncic has got five points now in the quarter. Oh, nice touch on Luka's mid-range there. The product of a lot of practice time and natural talent. Green kicks to Curry. Pass to Wiggins. To the middle. And stolen by Gasol. And here's the break. Now, here's Morant for three. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Morant's got 13. Yeah, letting it rip. They're just having fun right now. Man, their offense is clicking. Players, coaches, everybody, they are in sync. No one near Curry as he lets it go. No good, unable to end this run. Anjic passes to Booker. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the third quarter. And it's Wiggins with the ball for the Warriors. Green in the high post. Outside Curry. Wiggins from outside. Chicago grabs the miss. Gasol's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Morant reaches to Booker. Back to Morant. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Booker right side on the wing Doncic. And Booker kicks to Doncic. No good on the three. Doncic is gone just two of six shooting, 33%. It's Curry outside. And it's rebounded by Morant. Curry's gone only four of 11 from the field. Here's Booker and a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. That one is on heel. GA, when we think about Devin Booker's scoring ability, he always has been ahead of the curve. The youngest player ever to score 70 in a game, amongst the youngest to get to 10,000 points. Booker is on a historic scoring pace. And the Warriors making a change here. Freeze Jackson Davis has checked in for Looney. Kaminga comes in for Green. Moody's checked in for Heal, and it's De'Anthony Melton in for Curry. Richard, take a look at De'Anthony Melton's game. A combo guard and size him up for us. He's one of the combo guards that every team loves to have on their roster. He can hit an open three, but he can also guard a number one offensive player on the other end and take the challenge every single night. And the Warriors making a change here. Pochemski's checked in. Here's Melton. Offline with his three. Here's Chicago. They're on an 11 to 3 run. Five seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Booker, good. People first think of Booker as an outside shooter, but he does a lot of his work in the lane. Now, here's Melton. The tray. That one's not going to go. And so it's Chicago, out there all by themselves with a 32-point lead to end the quarter. They've been playing some ferocious defense. We'll get right back to the action when we return. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them, and, and what a beautiful feat. Serving it up on a platter, that is a beautiful dish. And two teammates on the same page, woo! And one quarter to go in a game that, to this point, has not been an evenly fought contest. Setting the floor for the Warriors. We've got Brandon Pajemski. Jonathan Kaminga out there with Trace Jackson Davis. Then it's DeAnthony Melton. And it's Moody in at the three, the small forward. And when the score is as lopsided as it is, and you can see they smell blood in the water, Hot Man is going for the jugular. Pass to Moody. 
Kaminga up top. Maxi grabs the miss. Tatum passes to Cork. The kick out to Tatum. The shot. And good as it just snugs right down through the net. No second thoughts from Tatum. Just look, he's ready. Pass to Pajemski. Fourth quarter just getting started. One minute in the books. Looking for Kaminga. He gets it there. And it's rebounded by Mashburn. Mashburn's got four rebounds in this game. Maxi, and he uses the glass on the way. Well-rounded effort, and, and they show no signs of letting up. Yeah, not just an impressive showing on offense, but on defense as well, executing their game plan perfectly. And it's Kaminga at the elbow. And Kaminga throws it down. He may not have that traditional power forward build, but his bounce, well, that kind of levels the playing field. Axie passes to Mashburn. No good from outside. Melton against Maxi. They get the rebound. Kaminga, screen on Maxi. Took the opportunity when he saw it. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they're just disappearing like they're not even there. You gotta show some fire and keep defending. Yeah, he, he's shown terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. He's locked in with his teammates right now, setting guys up in perfect position. Pass to Jackson Davis. Moody with it. Nobody near Melton. And all around the rim that time before dropping in. Melton's got five points now this quarter. Tatum finds eight. They swipe it. Here's Melton. Pass to Moody. Pajemski on the wing. Off target on the 15-footer. They have been really controlling this one. You never want to be complacent on the floor. That's when you lose momentum. This is how confident Tatum is. Knows he can score inside whenever he wants. Melton feeling it out a bit. Here's Jackson Davis. Now Pajemski. Over Carter. Shot by Pajemski, no good. And you have to like how they're moving the ball right now. Snappy passes to ready shooters. It's basketball 101, but boy, is it working. Count that one for Mashburn. And you have to be cognizant of Mashburn's long-range shooting ability. This guy is really accurate from out there. Pass to Pajemski. And here is Kaminga. Back to Pajemski. Kaminga, screen on court. Here's Pajemski. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. Yeah, I love the competitive fire right there. You train a triple on us, and I'm coming for my revenge. And credit the whole team. It was a focused, concerted effort to put this one away. And it felt like they just flipped the switch to go on that run and seal the game. Saving their best basketball for the end. Always smart. Here's Pajemski. And it's Chicago with the rebound. 35 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And it's Carter penetrating. And Vince Carter with the slam. And you know Carter is taking off on the drive when he has a head of steam like that he's looking to tear off the rim here's Pajemski defended by Carter pass to Melton to the inside and Jackson Davis gets it to go saw the angles and led him right to the hoop with that pass and guys they can just sit on the ball here if they want to they have earned this one Heads up on the money pass by Maxi. Great vision. 
Melton against Maxi. And here's Melton. And so Chicago takes this one and by a big margin. They poured it on tonight. Dominant showing in front of a crowd that loved every minute of it. And you know, this game could really be a defining one for what they can do when they are playing at their best. I mean, being here at home, no doubt helps. And the execution was flawless. And that about wraps it up. And so for Richard Jefferson, Greg Anthony, and our reporter David Aldridge, I'm Kevin Harlan. Thank you for tuning in to watch the NBA on 2K Sports. But as we go, let's take a look at our player of the game, Vince Carter.